Back up. And action! We're making a biopic about Richard Montanez's life. I got an idea. It's a spicy chip. It's gonna change everything. This man is responsible for the success of the Flaming Hot Cheeto and this huge global brand, and we need to know that. New products do not get created by blue-collar hoodlums who probably can't spell the word hoodlum. It's not just being the underdog or a rags to riches story. This is a story about when people underestimate you, not only as a person, as a community. Guys like you and me, we don't get shots like this, so don't blow it. And so to be able to explore our community through his lens has been a blessing. Say, the Hispanic market will not be ignored. The Hispanic market will not be ignored. Good, but in your voice. This has been the best filming experience of my life. Because of what we're shooting, the story that we're telling is so important. I'm Mexican, and we spend money on snacks just like everybody else. As a Mexican-American, I didn't even know the story, and I was like, oh my god, this is such an inspiring story to be reflected back on the big screen. Action! He was a warrior, man. She's just a force. There's no way this movie could have been made without her. To be working with a woman who has been so successful as an actress and now has been paving away as a director and a producer. I mean, working with Eva has been a dream. Everybody read the script and said, oh my God, I need to do this film. And that's why I wanted to surround myself with people who had the same energy and passion as I did to make a very special film that has never been done before. There's this whole market that no one else is paying attention to, us. This story resonated with me because his story is my story. Having the discipline and desire to not have more, be more. And I think everybody is going to say there's a piece of me that is reflected on the screen and in this story.